do you want to install a top work on your microwave and you don't know how to you want to teach you step by step do this most people they don't they don't want to do these type of shops so here um, the main advantage that you're going to have is that all the fumes uh, from the food or the smoke or whatever is going uh, straight outside. You don't have to deal with it, you know, being inside of the house that sometimes you maybe if you have a small detector that's very close, it's going to go off. So that is what the problem is had the, the customer. So I'm going to teach you step by step how you can do it. Most people, they don't do that. So they just install it, you know, the fumes goes in, into the microwave and then it goes exactly to the same room where it took it from. So this is going to help you and you, you can charge very well to do these type of shops. So now I'm going to show you step by step how you can do it. All right. So in the beginning, you are going to have these fans going over there. So you have to screw them from here. And then from here, you just turn it to the other side and that's it. And then we are adapting that. So that way we can put it on top of this and put it on the conduit that we have over there. I made all the holes, as you can see, that goes through the whole cabinet. And then it's going to go outside. All right, as you can see, we are outside. So as you can see, we have a, another paint that is from the bathroom. So uh, the, I, I use a long drill bit, as you can see from the inside. So that way I know the center and then I can make a hole through this side because doing the same hole from the inside it was going to be way difficult. All right, as you can see, I use the long drill bit. So that way I know exactly where to make the hole because from here to the other side you, you cannot reach it with the hole so that is four and, and a quarter as you can see here so I'm going to do the, use the same thing outside or if you have a brick yeah you can use that one that's the same thing all right as you can see I made the adapter here so as you can see we're going to put some screws here on the side some screws here on the side and we should get now we're going, we have to make a big hole so that way the whole thing can fit uh, here, as you can see, and that's it. So we're going to use the multi-tool for that. There we have the hole. We're going to make a mark here, so that way I know how, where to cut. So I should go over here like this. Right, as you can see, we're putting the work dot, uh, the dot work over there, so the way all the things can go outside. Now we're going to remove the screw that you see over there. We're going to put it in automatic. All right, as you can see, we have the new one over there, so everything looks uh, good. Now we're going to connect it inside, and that's it. As you can see, the hole is great. Now we can. Put this like this, and um, that's it. Enough. Now we have that in place. Now we have to put it back. Here I try to put it with the. Um, adapter that I, I did but it wasn't working it was not going to fit so I had to put it a later but it's very easy just lift it up with two people so that way it will make your life easier and uh, that's it once it's in place make sure that you put it first on the on the bottom and then you know you lift it up slowly and then put the screws on the top and that's it once it's one once it is firm and tight you can put just the adapter that i just made with a few screws and it will stay in place i am in us if you need tools i can send it to you otherwise if you're here in us i can give you the link and you can buy the tools that i've been using in, in this video so now i'm going to connect it the way it was now i have to make it this a little bit uh, bigger because the the adapter wasn't fitting but uh, that's it now we're going to put it on that, 
and some zip ties, some screws around the area, and we should be good. Okay, all done. Now we clean up and that's it. All right, now we're going to test it. As you can see, it works very good. Now we're going to the side and let's see how it, how it goes. As you can see, the, the little compartment, the wing is, is working and I, you know, you have all the fumes going outside. So you can see it's going up. Yeah. It's suction the the air very good. 